Tanawan, officially the city of Tanawan, Tagalog, Lungsod ng Tanawan, or simply known as Tanawan City, is a second-class city in the province of Batangas, Philippines. According to the 2015 census, it has a population of 173,366 people. It is incorporated as a city under Republic Act No. 9005, signed on February 2, 2001, and ratified on March 10, 2001. With the continuous expansion of Metro Manila, the city is now part of Manila's conurbation which reaches Lipa in its southernmost part. The city shares its borders with Calamba, Laguna, to the north, Tagaytay, Cavite, to the northwest, Talisay to the west, Santo Tomas to the east, and the towns of Balet and Malvar to the south. It borders on Tall Lake to the west. The town is known for the old Tanawan Church ruins, the most important archaeological site in the municipality where human remains from the colonial era have been unearthed. Among those born in Tanawan are revolutionary former Prime Minister Apolinario Mabina and former President Jose P. Laurel. History Some people believe that Tanawan derived its name from the Tagalog term Tana, meaning to look after through the window. This is based on a fortress which had a watchtower built by the Augustinian friars and natives. The watchtower allowed them to monitor incoming champions or boats entering through the Pansipit River, which were either traders or pirates. From this tower, one can have a clear view Tana, of the lake and of the vast plains and rolling hills. The town of Tanawan was founded on its present location in 1754, having been transferred from the fringe of Tall Lake where it was originally situated. It is generally believed that Tanawan, together with Sala was founded in 1572 by the Augustinian missionaries who built a mission at the shore of the lake known as Bonbon, now Tall. The town, however, was totally destroyed during the most impressive and catastrophic historically recorded eruption of Tall Volcano in 1754. Together with the community of Sala, the residents of Tanawan were relocated to safer places. Tanawan moved to Banyadero, then to its present location. Sala, on the other hand, transferred from its original site to where it is located now. Sala subsequently became a barangay of Tanawan. Tanaoeños have displayed characteristics of personal independence and nationalism since early history. The town is called the Cradle of Noble Heroes due to its contribution to the revolutionary movement of its sons Apolinario Mabina, the brains of Katipunan, and later by the statesman José P. Laurel. Also, three Tanaoeños served as governors of Batangas, namely, José P. Laurel v. Modesto Castillo and Nicolas González. Recent events include the assassination of its former mayor, César V. Platon, by NPA rebels on 7 May 2001, as he was running for the governorship of Batangas. This happened a few days before the election. On 2 July 2018, then incumbent Mayor Antonio Halili, noted for public humiliation campaigns against criminals and drug pushers, was assassinated during the flag raising ceremony at the city hall. Cityhood The Congress approved the then Batangas 3rd District Rep. Macario Laurel's bill and a Senate counterpart measure on December 19, 2000, the Republic Act No. 9005, known as the Charter of the City of Tanawan. On February 2, 2001 President Gloria Arroyo signed it into law. On March 10, 2001, a Saturday, the Charter was approved by a referendum in Tanawan that drew 8,890 or 16% of the 55,453 registered voters. Two ballots were either spoiled or blank. The. Yes. Had it over the. No. By a landslide, 7,026 to 1,961. According to cityhood advocates, quoted in reports reaching Batangas on Sunday, the turnout, despite being two times better than previous conversion to city exercises, was still only 16%. It suggested that 84% of Tanaoeños were in any of the following states regarding cityhood. They were not aware of what was going on. They were aware of the cityhood plan and were indifferent to it. They were aware, were in favor of the cityhood plan, but were too lazy to take part in the plebiscite. They were aware, were against cityhood, and voted by their feet. Geography Barangays 
Tanawan is politically subdivided into 48 barangays. La Playa District A cluster of the six lakeshore barangays of Tanawan which serves as the tourism district of the city. It is consist of barangays Ma. Paz Wawa Booth Gonzales Banadero Ambulong Demographics Religion Roman Catholicism is the most dominant and visible religion in Tanawan. Saint John the Evangelist is its patron, and its main church is the Saint John the Evangelist Parish. La Consolación College Tanawan, formerly Our Lady of Fatima Academy, 1948, run by the Augustinian Sisters of Our Lady of Consolation, is the first Catholic school in the city. Other Catholic schools include Our Lady of Assumption Montessori School and Daughters of Mary Immaculate School, lay operated. First Asia Institute is converting from a non-sectarian school to a Catholic Christian school. Iglesia ni Cristo, Jehovah's Witnesses, Mormons, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, Islam and other religious groups are also present in the city. Economy Tanawan is known as an agricultural trading center of Calabarzon region. Agri products from Calabarzon and as far as Mimaropa and Bicol regions are being sent here before it reaches Metro Manila public markets. Aside from being an important agricultural center, Tanawan is also one of the Philippines' major industrial centers nowadays hosting four industrial parks which is home to various multinational companies and tourism facilities. First Philippine Industrial Park a 450-hectare industrial park owned by Lopez Group and Sumitomo Corporation located in Tanawan and Santo Tomas, Batangas. FPIP Tanawan is the location of various multinational companies such as Nestle, Honda, Brother Printers, Canon Philippines, Shimano, B.E. Aerospace, Philip Morris Fortune Tobacco Corporation and many more. First Industrial Township Incorporated Formerly Philtown Technology Center located in Brgy. Pagaspas which is now owned by First Philippine Holdings of the Lopez Group of Companies. This is home to Uni President Philippines, the manufacturer of Homey Instant Noodles and Nuda Crunch. Dolores Industrial Park An industrial park in the Tanawan Malvar area. It is the location of Metro Manila Turf Club. Data Land Industrial Park An industrial park owned by Data Land Corporation. This hosts the precast manufacturing facility of the said company. Tanawan City Zentrum A multi-sectoral development by the Torres Group of Companies located at the center of the new Tanawan Central Business District. It is now the location of the new Tanawan City Hall, which was inaugurated last July 23, 2017. In front of the new City Hall is the new Tanawan People's Park. Aside from government centers, TCZ will also host office towers, condominiums and commercial centers by 2019. Tagaytay Highlands Tourism Economic Zone by Bell Corporation Transportation Public transport Jeepneys serve the city and the nearby municipalities and barangays. Tricycles provide transportation on the barangays. Buses connect the city with Manila and Batangas City. Roads The Southern Tagalog Arterial Road passes at the central part of the city. The expressway connects the city with the rest of Batangas. Jose P. Laurel Highway connects the city to Calamba and Santo Tomas on the north and with Malvar, Lipa, and Batangas City to the south. Another highway links Tanawan with Talisay and Tagaytay. A 7.8 km miles service road on both sides of Star Tollway will connect the northeastern barangays of Tanawan to the southeastern barangays of the city. 
Aside from the Star Tollway, national roads like the Jose P. Laurel Highway, Route 4, and Tanawan Talisay Road, Route 421, serves also the city. The city also maintains roads that connects the rural barangays of the city. Education among the tertiary educational establishments in Tanawan is the First Asia Institute of Technology and Humanities, La Consolación College, Nova Shola, the STI Academic Center, the DMMC Institute of Health Sciences, and the Tanawan Institute. The Tanawan Institute is the oldest private education institution in the city having been established in 1924. The Sapphire International Aviation Academy which caters to aspiring aircraft pilots is also located within the city at the Baradas Airstrip. There are 9 private and 12 public high schools, and 27 private and 44 public elementary schools. Heads of Government Notable People Prez, Jose P. Laurel, former President of the Philippines, Founder, Lyceum of the Philippines, LPU Manila Apolinario Mabina, the Great Paralytic Salvador Laurel, former Vice President of the Philippines Sen. Sotero Laurel, former Senator, Founder, Lyceum of the Philippines University Batangas and Laguna, Zanjo Marudo, Actor, ABS-CBN, Jade Lopez, Actress, GMA7, Renato Corona, Former Chief Justice, 2010-2012, El Gama Penumbra Carlo Pagulayan, Cartoonist, Marvel Heroes, Joshua Garcia, Actor, ABS-CBN, Diane Querer, TV Host and News Anchor, PTV4, Ka Louis Tabing, Veteran Broadcaster, Sa Kabukiran, DZMM600, 30, references external links Official website of the Local Government of Tanawan City Philippine Standard Geographic Code Philippine Census Information 2010 Comelec Results, Tanawan. Encyclopedia Britannica, 11th ed., 1911.